Thank you for coming. I really I spoke to my family, and I think my grandmother said it beautifully when she said, I'm her Asfur. Asfur in Arabic means her bird. And she said, I'm her dream manifested. I am her free bird. So why would I come back and be caged and bow down when my election rolls her head up high? I know that when we can finally see them as deserving of you. We all decided as a family that I could not go until I was a free American United States Congresswoman coming there, not only to see my grandmother, but to talk to Palestinian and Israeli organizations that believed that my grandmother deserved human dignity as much as anyone else does. You will need to state the reason for your visit. Don't say, because olives are ready for harvest and I will coax the fruit. There's a piece of you that gets broken, especially when I grew up here and I grew up in the most beautiful blackest city in the country where you don't let anybody tell you you're less than or humiliate you solely based on your faith or your ethnicity. And as a United States Congresswoman, I could not do that to my grandmother. Leading up to the trip, I met with constituents holding a wide range of views. On we have a responsibility to conduct oversight over our government's foreign policy and what happens with the millions of dollars we send in aid. So I would encourage my colleagues to visit, meet with the people we were going to meet with, see the things we were going to see.